everybody, it's me Stacy here at Scrapbooking Made Simple, scrapbookingmadesimple.com and it is time for our Make It Monday event featuring Memory Box this week. I have Memory Box for you. Oh, and it is so good. It is. And free gifts on top of all of that. Now, for those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. I'm Stacy. I'm the owner of Scrapbooking Made Simple. I do three YouTube classes a week. I do Make It Mondays, Monday at 5 p.m. Sunday California time, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern. I have our Tuesday expedited what's new, latest and greatest at value pricing classes. <laughs> also 5 p.m. Sunday California time, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern. And then on Saturday mornings, I have a full length technique class that is totally commercial free. And when I say full length, I mean it. So <laughs> that starts at 8 a.m. Sunday California time, 10 a.m. Central, 11 a.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. in the United Kingdom. And we live chat through all of these events all of them. Now today, Make It Monday is all about Memory Box, where I bring you maybe not necessarily the latest collection from Memory Box, but some of their greatest products at value pricing. Typically, we have a one bundle event for our Make It Mondays, where we offer you a bundle for $19.99 that could retail for up to $100 or more sometimes. Really, honestly, no tricks, no games. It is the truth. Today, today it's about a lot of little bundles. I've got a lot of little bundles, and if you were to add them all up, well, magically they come to right around $19 and 90 some odd cents. But I didn't get everything in equal quantity, so I couldn't make them all the same. <laughs> I have a little more of this and a little less of this, but all of it is amazing. And yes, we offer expedited shipping on this on this event. So if you want your product shipped super fast, boom, bing, boom, then all you have to do is follow the criteria in our Make It Monday category. You'll see there's a paragraph that tells you what you need to do to qualify for expedited shipping. Doesn't mean that you're going to pay more for your shipping. It means that we downstairs in the retail store, when the store is slow, we are able to pull these orders fast and get them out to you. As long as the store stays slow, <laughs> I don't know which is better, the store staying slow or us being able to ship faster, I'm not 100% positive, but as long as the store is slow, we're able to fill these orders and get these out to you. You just have to follow the little terms and conditions in the Make It Monday category. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna tilt on down. I'm going to walk you through each of the bundles first. Then I'm going to play with it for just a little bit. And then I have beautiful samples to show you. When does this event go live? Well, at the end of our live chat, as we're wrapping this up, I will say ready, set, go. And that means we have turned this on, on our online store at scrapbookingmadesimple.com. Can you also buy this in our retail store? Yes, we have it available in our retail store as well. Do we have unlimited quantities? No. <laughs> I've got a little of this, a little more of that, and a little more of that, but I don't have unlimited quantities. So it is first come, first serve. And what I always recommend is if you miss something, put yourself on the notify me list because Quite frequently, we get people who will cancel their orders or they double ordered and they need to cancel one. And then an email goes out to all those on the notify me list saying, hey, something's become available, but then it is the first come first served again. The first ones to get it in their cart and checked out will be the ones that the product is allocated to. We do not allocate product when it is in your cart. Your order, the product is allocated to your order after you've submitted your order. And that's pretty standard for an online store, whether it be us or a huge chain. They don't allocate the product until you've actually hit the submit button. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six bundles for you, I think, today. 
And again, if you were to purchase all six of them, it still would be like $19.99. And with five of them, there's a free gift to go with it. So are you ready for today's Make It Monday? I am so excited that you are here. If you see the live chat going on, that means this is the premiere of the class and the product will be made live after we are done. When I say ready, set, go. If you don't see a live chat going on, the sale has already started. The event is on or it could be over. All right, so I'm gonna tilt down. We're gonna get started. It's good to see everybody. And um, today's just a really nice play day. It's a little overcast. We're expecting rain. This is like a great day to stay in and craft. All right, you guys, down we go. Bye. All right, so zoom on in. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Down, down, down. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Okay, I think I'm good. All right, let's start with bundle number one. I have 3D embossing folders. 3D embossing folders from Memory Box. The bundle retails for $26.97. Now, 3D embossing folders run, I think theirs run like $8.99, $9 maybe for each of them. Your price is $4.99. Really, it's $4.99. No joke, it's $4.99. Not each, but $4.99 for all three. Now, one of them we've had in an event before. It's the, it's the kind of the planetary one. But my gosh, these two, are worth the worth the price of admission right there you're going to get all three of them for four dollars and 99 cents it's not even like buy one get one free no it's less than that <laughs> it's not even buy one get two free that's crazy right so I am gonna play with these for a little bit because I want to show you how to use them but what do we have to go along with these well, this is where the other five bundles come in and each of them have the same free gift. So if you were going to get all five of these bundles, well, congratulations, you've got five free gifts to go with it. All right, so I'm gonna pull it apart. So this is bundle number one and it is their fairy sugar. This has four colors of fairy sugar in them and it would retail for $9.16. Your price is $2.99. So I have got the mint frost, which is kind of a transparent. I've got lemon drop, I've got strawberry ice, and I've got dew drop, which is kind of the, the all purpose transparent. So four of them for $2.99. But then I have, wait, I have a free gift for you. And this is the free gift for every bundle. I've got honey, I have got fennel, and oh, these are hard, and myrtle. So now you're actually getting seven colors for $2.99. Now these two look a lot alike, but they are, oh, you can see the difference. I think you can see that one's darker and one's lighter. So not nine dollars and sixteen cents which is what these would have cost add another seven dollars here if we wanted to add another seven dollars that makes it sixteen dollars for two dollars and ninety nine cents this is bundle number one then we go to bundle number two and see it's already attached <laughs> Bundle number two has four more colors. $9.16 retail, $2.99 plus three free gifts. This time you're going to get, ooh, yay, right? This time you're going to get Twilight, you're going to get Lavender, you're going to get Orange Sorbet, and you're going to get, oh, I can't read it. It's, 
I don't know if it, I can't, I can't read it. Plum, something, it's just too dark on the, for me to see it. I don't know, maybe you guys can see it if I zoom in. I can't see it. Can you read it down there? At any rate, you're gonna get these four wonderful colors and you're going to get here. So if you were to buy the bundle number one and bundle number two, you'd have these here, plus you'd have two sets Now that's going to cost you, all of this is going to run $6. Three of these is $6. No, actually three of these is more than $6. Okay, so there's our, there's bundle number one and bundle number two. Let's move to bundle number three. Bundle number three has a few more than four. Bundle number three has six. Retail value is $13.74. Your price is $4 and, and no, $4.49. And I think that there's six in here. So now, boy, I just destroyed that bag. <laughs> Now you're going to get, this is Sour Apple, this is Buttercup Glow, this is, oh I can't read it, it's just too dark, a beautiful blue. This one is, I don't know, Eucalyptus maybe? Then we have got Lemon Drop Meringue, and then we've got Goldfinch. So those are the six that come and again you're going to get the other three. So now you'll have all three greens and you'll have all three oranges for sure. And this bundle runs $4.49 not the $13.74. Okay let's move that along. I'm going to put these over here. Bundle number four. free gifts. Bundle number four has four colors, $19.16 regularly. Your price is $2.99. And oh, we've got the beautiful pinks and reds. Right? Can't tell you. I can't, the, the, I can't read the color. It's just too, it's too dark. Uh, mm -mm, they're just too hard to read. The color of the glitter is too dark against it. That's okay. They are very pretty. So bundle number four gives you these four colors and these three colors. No matter what bundle you buy, you're going to get these three colors. We had oodles of that, and I thought, you know, we're just going to make it a free gift. So that's bundle number four. And then our last bundle is bundle number five. Bundle number five is only two colors and it's $1.49, not $4.58. And it is just your everyday fabulous gold and silver. Colors you use all the time, colors you need all the time, colors that you can stock up on, but of course you're going to get it with the extra three. So for your $1.49, you're actually getting five of them, right? So all the colors that we have, let's see, let's go here and here and here. These are all the different colors that come in, the different bundles. And if you were to order all five bundles, you would then end up with five of the free gift in the honey, 
five of the free gift in the myrtle and five of the free gift in the fennel. So you'd end up with five, five, five if you were to get one of each. So here's bundle number one with the free gift. Here's bundle number two with the free gift. Here's bundle number three with the free gift. Here's bundle number four with the free gift. And last but not least, bundle number five with the free gift. Okay, you guys, I mean, that's amazing. That's, that's incredible for the price, unbelievable. Between the $4.99 for the embossing folders, 3D embossing folders from Memory Box to their fairy sugar. If you think you might need gifts for the holidays, boy oh boy, is this a great time to get them. You can open these up and divvy them up any way you see fit. You need teacher's gifts, you need inexpensive things for the classroom so that they can be making Mother's, well, Mother's Day's over, Father's Day and holiday and, and fall and, and Thanksgiving that you wanna be able to have glitters for them, glitter glues, this is a super affordable way to pick these up. Okay, amazing. Now let's start with the embossing folders. So Memory Box's 3D embossing folders tend to be a little thicker than most. They're almost like a Sizzix embossing folder 3D. They are thicker than you're used to. A little bit heavier, a little bit thicker, like a Sizzix embossing folder. It is three-dimensional, which means you're going to get a lot of lift and pop from your embossing folder. It really has that extra dimension built into it. However, the sandwich is a little different than some of the other 3D embossing folders. Can you see how thick that embossing folder is? And I wanna show you how to use it. So, for this sandwich, and if, if this is if you're using a Sizzix machine, if you're using a Big Shot or a Vagabond or a Pro or a Plus or a Switch, or a Big Kick, or a Fabby, or a Vintage, even the old Ellison machine, I think you're gonna need to use this type of a platform. This is the original, this is the, the base that comes with your Sizzix Big Shot machine. Typically it comes with this, and then there's a solo shim that goes over the top of it. Uh, do I have my solo shim here? Yes. Typically there's a solo shim that will fit over the top of it. It comes with the machine. And then you would put a cut plate down and then your die and your paper and a do not cut plate. And that's, that's a sandwich we use most often with this machine. But with a 3D embossing folder as thick as Memory Box or as thick as Sizzix, they show you right on this base plate how to do it. Right here, 3D embossing folders. The sandwich is right there for you, and Memory Box is one that's going to fit this sandwich, which means I start with my base plate, then I take my paper, put it in my embossing folder. Typically, I would have a bottom plate here, but this time I don't. And I'm gonna sandwich this just a little bit. I'm gonna trim this down. This time I don't have a bottom plate. I'm gonna take my embossing folder straight to my base plate. Now it's not gonna hurt the base plate because an embossing folder doesn't have any cut edges. So it's not going to cut into my base plate at all. It's as smooth as plastic, because it is. So I'm gonna put my embossing folder there and then I'm going to take a cut plate or a do not cut plate and sandwich it over the top. So I am completely eliminating my bottom cut plate and my solo shim. And then I'm going to send it on through. Now, once you get it in, it rolls just like butter. And if you want, you can absolutely bring it back. It's up to you. It's not gonna hurt it. And 
and then I bring it over and now I have got an amazing embossing 3D one side two sides which side do you like better let's just look at the difference between them so So now you decide which side do you like best, top or bottom. That's assuming you want to ink them. You don't have to. You can just let it be. But if you were to ink them straight over the top, this is what you'd be looking at. But what if we ink them in the folder? Is that going to change things? It's going to change things dramatically. Dramatically. What if we take and we ink straight to the folder. And I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use my Hero Hues, my Hero Arts Cube inks. And let's see what we've got. Let me zoom on in. And I'm gonna ink both sides. Some people only ink one side of their folder, but paper has two sides. And you may find that when you're done rolling it through, you like one side better than the other. So we're going to look at that. We're going to look at both sides this time and see what we get. In fact, I'll roll it. Maybe I should roll it through twice so we can do apples to apples. All right. So do I start with my, my blue, my yellow? So I'm going to take and run my ink all over. I always start with my lightest color. And I want to make sure that I get all over. That way I'm sure that if I don't hit it with one of my other colors, I know that that yellow at least is going to come through. Okay, so yellow done. Now maybe I hit it with my blue a little bit. And I don't want to do too much because I want to leave some of that yellow there. And then let's come in with maybe my rust. I don't know. We'll try. And again, I don't want to hit all over because I want to leave some of that yellow that I've done. And I'm using a dye based ink. That way the ink doesn't dry on the folder. The folder is plastic. So it is non porous. That ink is going to stay wet right on it. bring over and send it on through and roll, 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 roll. And if I want, I can come back. Now that, that's pretty cool. But that's not the only side I have. I have this side as well. So I'm gonna do this one more time and I'm gonna use the same colors. And I'm gonna roll it through again. That way I can show you apples to apples. So what did I start with? I started with my yellow, right? And I liked getting it up all the way around. I think that actually, I like that border. And this is a felt topped ink pad. It can be foam, that's fine. If it's foam though, you just wanna use a little less pressure because foam is gonna have some give and it's going to sink in more on the embossing folder than perhaps you want. So a felt, top it has a, it's it, it doesn't give nearly and so it lets it kind of sit on top of the folder and then I did the blue right 
And I just did a little blue. And then I came in with the rust. And a little bit of rust. All right, and a piece of paper. And I'm going to close it up. So all we've done is a wash, rinse, and repeat. And then we can look to apples to apples and see which side we like better. And is there any more that we can do with it? So $4.99 for this folder alone would have been a smoking hot deal. It would have, but you're getting the other two folders too. People are like, how can she do this? Well, because I work with really great manufacturers is how I can do it. <laughs> they allow me the opportunity to bring crafting to you at a price that makes your heart happy and makes it more affordable for many of you. So remember, so now I'm gonna cut away, this one I actually like, I'm gonna cut it right out. I like that noise kind of around the outside. I'll cut one with and one without. I call all the extra ink around it, kind of the noise, because it can distract. You don't think you like it, but then you cut it all away when you're blending and all of a sudden your eyes are focused in on, oh boy, I cut that really, really wonky, Stacy. So there we go. And there we go. And then I'm gonna cut this one down so we can go side by side. And this one I am, I'm gonna cut all the noise off. See, I'm gonna cut all that back off, which I happen to really like. But on this side, I don't need it. Okay. So now, are you side A or side B? Side A, side B. Okay, say it with me. You don't have to choose. You get both. You have options. Did we say that together? One, two, three. You have options. But wait, let's do it one more time. I hope I have enough paper. <laughs> Let's do it one more time and let's just keep to the same colors and then we will move to the next one. So I have my yellow. All over, that way I'm sure that at least every place has got some color. And always start with your lightest colors because if I start with a dark color and I try to go back on top with my light color, the light color will be will be absorbed in by that darker color. It's like trying to put a color on black. Let's say you have black paper and you color it with red. That red absorbs into the black and it disappears. Well, same thing here. If I start with a dark color, that yellow is going to absorb in. And let's go some cool because we're just keeping things apples to apples and just rust. And my paper. Close it up. Bring it on over and send it on through. And every one of them is going to be a little different because I've inked each of them a little different. I've used the same colors, but the ink's certainly not in the exact same place every time. 
So send it through. Now, will your embossing folders clean off? Absolutely. Dye-based ink is a water-based ink. It's water-soluble. At least the Hero Arts is. In fact, it does most of the transfer, but if you want, you just take your baby wipe, go in there, and pick up any residual color. If you need to, you can use a hand sanitizer to go in there and pick up your color because all this is is a molded plastic. That's all this is is a molded piece of plastic that allows that embossing to happen. So here we've got and this time, this time I'm going to cut it in half. And then what? Well, what if we took, what if we took one of our colors and went over the top of what we've already done? What if we took our yellow? Let's see if I've got, take our yellow. And now I'm hitting the highest point of that embossing. I'm hitting the rest of the circle that was white. Because this is 3D, you've got down deep, you've got up high, and now I'm hitting my color. I'm not changing my blue or my rust because that's down below. That's where my, my ink pad can't hit it anymore. So I had that and I changed it to that. Hmm, what do you think? What if we do it on this one? Let's change the color. Let's do this one maybe in the blue. So I still have my rust circle and my yellow circles and my little blue circles, but now I've added color to the raised up element of the 3D embossing folder. I had that, now I have that. Which do you like better? Hmm. And remember, we could have left them just like that. Or we can change them even more. That is a lot of options for $4.99. And this is just the one. I've got two others to do, right? You choose. This all came, these four different looks came out of one embossing folder. Mm -hmm. All right, let's change over to the other embossing folder. Let me grab that one. Let's go with this one. This one is, what do you call this one? I don't know. 3D embossing folder. These are crafty to help you create. I, I don't know what the, I don't know what the name is, but okay. Love you, Dave. So same thing. Let's see how much white paper I've got. <laughs> oh, I think I have. I, I might have just enough. <laughs> I think I have more down here. <laughs> okay, so let's, do we need to see it embossed? Just plain embossed? put it at a slight angle help it go through a little easier 
There we go. And do I want to come back? Sure I do. Actually, we had one, two, three, four, five, six from that one embossing folder, not to mention just white. That's all out of that same embossing folder. So we're gonna do the same thing with this one. So here we have it, white. You've got kind of a waffly look to it. Wait till you see the card made with this one. SMS, honorary SMS girl, Katie looked at that and she said, I see chocolate squares. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so let's do, um, let's do some of it maybe in orange. And let's do some of it in pink. And then it comes down to which side do you like better? It's the same embossing folder with two different sides, or you leave it just plain on any pattern or colored paper. You just add the texture. Same embossing folder, two different looks. Let's ink it up. Ink, ink, ink. Folder, folder, folder. So, cause I'm me, I'm gonna start with yellow. This time I went with my lemon yellow. Let's add a bunch of lemon yellow. That way I am sure that no matter where my paper hits, there'll be some color. And again, this is a dye-based ink. Could I do this with stays on? Yikes. Stays on is meant to dry on non-porous material like plastic. So it may dry faster than you can get it through your machine. I'm adding a little bit of orange. And maybe a little bit of pink. All right, let's see what we got. Put my paper in. Remember, it's just my base plate. That's it, just my base plate. My embossing folder straight to that base plate, a cut plate or a do not cut plate, it doesn't make a difference, and then send it on through. Up, and I'm gonna angle it at just a little bit of an angle to help it feed in a little smoother. And do I want to send it back? Sure, why not? So now I have this. Or I have that. Let's do it again so we can compare apples to apples. some orange and 
and some pink. And let's see what we get. Paper in. Machine over. Send it on through. A little bit of an angle so it feeds in at an angle. It feeds into your machine much easier if you don't have a parallel line of a die or an embossing folder to the, the roller. Send it through, send it back. We don't have to, but since I have to take it out anyway, So now we've got two of the same, two of the same, but here are your two options in full size. So this one, this one's just one color because I just took one color over it. Kind of be hard to get the blend, but by putting it on the embossing folder, I get a beautiful blend. Same here, it's one color, but to get those blends, you mix it right on the, mix it right on the embossing folder. All right, so let's do one more in the same color, so then I can snip it in half and we can add that extra little bit. Yellow. Yellow. And maybe this time I do the pink first. Now you're saying, what about your, your pad? What, what happens? Do you get yellow on it? You do. So now I just need to Wipe it on out until my pink comes back. Once my yellow is out, my pink will come back and I'm good to go. Okay, and then orange. That's the beautiful thing about the Hero uh, Arts inks is that you can blend them and then they just will come clean. You just clean them right off with a piece of paper And then the color's true again. All right, let's send it on through. little bit of an angle just so it feeds through a little bit easier great there we go there we go I like it with the extra around it, but it's up to you. This one I'm going to cut off. And then I'm going to cut it in half. Because right now what we've got is the same as what we've been doing here or there, but if I cut it in half, now I decide what color to go over the top. So 
So instead of it just being open, now I've colored in. or do I want it darker? I think I like it darker. So now instead of that, I have that. And all I did was add the color to the top where it's raised, that, Im that ink pad hit it to allow me to take all the white out. So now it's up to you. Which one do you like better? But wait, you don't have to choose. <laughs> you get it all. You get it, you get it all in one embossing folder. And there's more to do with these. This was just done straight color. This was done inking and this is both sides so if you flip it over you get the reverse and then this was done adding a little bit of ink to get rid of some of the white after I was all done it's wonderful it really is and then you can take then you can take a little bit of your your fairy sugar, which is very much like a stickles. Give it a little bit of a, a shake. It is a glue, a glitter glue. So if you needed to in a pinch, you could use it as a glue. A little bit on a foam sponge. You know what, make sure you kind of rub it in pretty good or, or you know spread it around so it's not so liquidy in all just one place. And then I could just come in and add a little bit of sparkle. And it's almost dry. This dries super fast. And now I've added a little bit of sparkle, right? Use your dauber, easiest thing ever. Let's see, let's change it so I don't have, let's grab, let's grab this one and we'll use the silver. It's a great way to put it down and have it dry really fast. It's almost dry. And a little dabble, do ya? Pretty, right? You've got this. You want, oh, I don't think I want any more gold in there. I'm happy with my gold and I'm happy with my silver. Now I've done the, I've got great samples of the, of the starlight, planetary, celestial. So I've got samples of those and I've done it before. So I really, really wanted to focus on, 
I really wanted to focus on these. And show you all the different things that can be done with them without doing much of anything at all. Embossing folders are one of the easiest ways to add texture and dimension. They're a tool, so if you take care of them, they last a lifetime. His fairy sugar, when applied like this, is dry. It dries crazy fast. It's dry. And you've got that little bit of sparkle and little bit of shine. And we did all of this with just one folder. Oh, I love that. It just kind of I don't know if you can see it. I don't know what my camera picks up and what it doesn't, but it's beautiful. It twinkles without it being overly glittery. Imagine doing this with all the other colors. Oh my gosh. I hope you can see it. It's beautiful. And it's easy. Where's the back side? So Wahoo Kachu for memory box. A big thank you to everybody, Dave and everybody at Memory Box for making this possible. And it just glitters. It's not in your face glitter. No, no, no. It's like, hello, how are you? Not hello, hello, pay attention to me. Here I am, look at me. I sparkle, 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 sparkle. It's like, I got a little bit of shimmer and a little bit of shine, but you, you have to notice me to notice me. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. Yeah, you have to notice me to notice me. <laughs> As opposed to, hello, 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 here I am, here I am, pay attention, pay attention. Sometimes we want a card or a project that says, hello, here I am, pay attention. And sometimes maybe you're making for something for somebody who is a little more, hey, how you doing? You know, but you want to add a little, maybe you are, well, that would be me. I'm hello, 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 pay attention, pay attention. But I have oodles of friends who are like, no, just notice me when you notice me. You have to notice me to notice me. And that's what this does. Oh, that makes my heart happy. So all of these were done with the one embossing folder. So many different ideas. So many, no, it's on my hands. It's already dry. Take a little bit of baby wipe to get that glue off because it is, it is a glue. You can almost peel it off like a glue. Easy to use, quick to dry. Kids love it. It doesn't make a big mess, especially if you put little sponges out for them. Just go get makeup sponges for the kids and let them have at it. All right, so three, no, yeah, three different embossing folders. One bundle should run $26.79. You're going to get all three of them for $4.99. And 
And then we have got bundle two, bundle three, <laughs> where's bundle one? <laughs> bundle five, <laughs> where's bundle one? Bundle four, has anybody seen bundle one? Did I open both of a bundle? Oh, wait a minute. Bundle two. Five, oh, bundle one. Two, three, four, five. Okay, and then I have five bundles of, oops, of his fairy sugar. And each one of them comes with three for free. So you, in bundle one, you're actually getting seven for $2.99 and in bundle number two you're getting seven for $2.99 and bundle number three you're getting nine and there are no duplicates nothing's duplicated nine for $4.49 and bundle four you're getting seven for $2.99 and last but not least bundle five you're getting five for $1.49 if that ain't keeping crafting affordable, my name is not Stacy Park. <laughs> yes, my name is Stacy Park. No S. P A R K. All right, let's do samples. You ready? Let me zoom in just a little bit. Ooh, right? Beautiful. here just using the embossing folder just the embossing folder as an accent beautiful here's my planetary look at that with the glitter on it and inked and it sparkles and it shines this is great for kids love that one a million thanks and look at how beautiful is this again just using the embossing folder as the textural element of the card to give it a little bit of depth, a little texture to it. It's there, but it's not in your face. Love the colors here. Look at how beautiful is that. Now, as subtle as this one, this one's a little happier. Look at how beautiful is that so pretty and as happy as this one is look at it in comparison to just inking the folder just a little bit such a contrast between the two two different friends two different occasions two different looks same embossing folder beautiful and then congratulations and again, this one is completely different. This one is a little softer, a little celestial. This one is, this one is, it's stars in the sky and you're taking advantage of all that negative space that the embossing folder gives you. So pretty. And here, here it is. Honorary SMS girl Katie saw a candy bar with those little checks, those little squares. So she fashioned this. She went, we had fun size candy bars in the store. Somehow she cut this off one of the fun size candy bars and she cut that down. How cute is that? Hello. And here we have love. And again, this is using some of the glitters. Just put in. Moved around just boop, boop, boop with your finger. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful things made. And if you were to end up getting one of everything, and again, some of it will sell out faster than others because we have more of some, less of others. But if you were to get it all, it's still only a little under $19.99. All right, you guys, it's me, Stacy. Scrapbooking Made Simple, scrapbookingmadesimple.com. Are we in love with the memory box stuff? Do we love the pricing? Can you see 
Can you see what we're trying, what my goal is? Yes, I have to stay in business. Don't get me wrong. I do. I have to stay in business. But there should be a balance. There should be a balance. You should be able to stay in business. Not going not gonna to make millions of dollars here. Not going to happen. I'm good with that. I made a lot of money in my past. So unhappy. So unhappy when I was in my 20s and I was making more money than any 26-year-old should ever make, ever. Miserable. Miserable. But now, we, we get by, we live okay, you live okay, and we're all able to celebrate our craft because we're able to keep it affordable. That's important to me. Yay! There's got to be a balance. Sometimes some of the brand new bundles that we bring out are not inexpensive. They're value priced, but they still could be well over $100. Now, it might be $80 off of what the normal price would be, and it's still over $100. And that's great for somebody who wants that new, new, new. Mondays are for those of you who love to craft, love of value are okay with it being a little bit older, see the potential in everything, and take advantage of that. Those of you on a crafty budget, those of you on a fixed income, those of you who, who shouldn't have to choose between bologna and milk and eggs or a gallon of gas, and maybe, maybe some of this fairy, maybe those 3D embossing folders for $4.99. Maybe this week you can have your bologna, your milk, your eggs, your gallon of gas, and three new embossing folders from Memory Box. Who knows? All right, you guys, are you ready? Set, go. The sale has started, the event has started. If we sell out of something, please, please be kind. Just put yourself on the notify me list and if it comes back, we send the email goes to everybody at the same time. You might have to put yourself on the notify me list two or three or four times before you're the only person on the notify me list. And then when the email goes out, it only goes to you. And then you go in and get what makes your heart happy. Just remember, I can only sell you what the manufacturers have to offer and we buy as much as we can and what we can afford. So I appreciate your understanding. All right, you guys, the sale has started. It is me, Stacy, Scrapbooking Made Simple, scrapbookingmadesimple.com. I will see you on Thursday. Thursday, I think, is, is Spellbinders. I think Thursday is Spellbinders. Say yes to Spellbinders. So join me 5 p.m. Sunday California time, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern, when I bring you the latest and greatest from our friends at Spellbinders. All right, you guys, thanks for being here today. I'll see you on Thursday. Bye, everybody.